Hey guys, welcome back to my channel Learn English with Harsha. So in today's lesson, I have come up with some alternative ways of using these common words in everyday sentences. So if you like my videos, subscribe my channel and don't forget to press the bell icon to get a notification when a new video is posted. So without any further ado, let's begin our lesson. All right, our first sentence is I am happy. You can replace the word happy with the words delighted or thrilled. Delighted is a feeling of great pleasure. For example, I am super delighted or I was delighted to win the basketball match. Now, when you are very happy and excited too, you can use the word thrilled. For example, I am thrilled to go for an adventurous trip. All right. Our next sentence is I am sad. You can replace the word sad with the words depressed, gloomy or pathetic. Now, let's see few sentences related to these words. I become gloomy when my teacher scolded me. She felt depressed or lonely when her friends stopped talking to her. Now, if you describe a person as pathetic, you mean that person is sad or helpless. For example, the patient is in a pathetic condition. Moving on to our next sentence, I am tired. You can replace the word tired with worn out, exhausted or pooped out. Now, let's see a few sentences. I am worn out. I was exhausted after the party. Or, I am pooped out. I am going to hit the sack. Now, hit the sack means to go to sleep. All right, moving on to our next sentence. I am afraid. You can replace afraid with the words terrified, petrified or creepy. So, terrified is a feeling of being extremely afraid. For example, the nightmare I had yesterday made me terrified or Yesterday's nightmare made me petrified. Now creepy means scary or afraid. For example, this place is really creepy. Let's get out of here. All right, moving on to our next sentence. I am lazy. If you describe a person as lazy, you mean they are unenergetic or inactive. So lazy can be replaced by the words couch potato or sluggish. So couch potato is a person who spends a lot of time watching TV or not doing any other work. For example, in lockdown you have become a couch potato and a heavy breakfast makes me sluggish the whole day. All right, moving on to our next sentence. I am surprised. Now surprised can be replaced by the words amazed or astonished. Amazed means extremely surprised. For example, I was amazed to see her in a beautiful dress and I was astonished to see that my old friend had recognized me. All right, moving on to our next sentence. I am angry. You can replace angry with the words annoy. For example, you can say I am annoyed or it really annoys me when you change the television channel every 10 minutes. Or when you are angry, you can say, I am in a black mood. So this is the end of the lesson. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please hit the like button and subscribe my channel. Thank you for watching. Take care of yourself. Bye-bye.